Who's there? Dear Anna, I'm writing to you with a heavy heart. Our family is in trouble. Your niece Jackie was murdered, and you are the only one who can catch the killer. I'll be waiting for you at the police department. Please help us, Alexander. Hello, Anna. I'm glad that you received my letter and agreed to help. Our whole family is devastated. I think that Jackie's murder is connected to similar killings that took place 17 years ago. My partner Chris Lewis and I couldn't solve these murders back then. Now I have to rely on your abilities. Take this. You'll find the case file in the archive. Hello, Anna. What sort of trouble are you in this time? Something happened to Jackie? Alright, this time it's something serious. No more jokes. I feel sorry for Alexander. Let's try to help him out together and hopefully save Jackie. I found something for you. It might be useful. A series of murders shook the town 17 years ago. It was a baffling case. The killer was never arrested. 17 girls died back then. All of them wore golden jewelry. They were the same age, and their hair seemed to turn gray all of a sudden. Every day, we found another one of the victims on the street. My partner Chris Lewis and I were the detectives who worked on the case. We've solved a lot of crimes together but not this one. No matter how hard we tried, we'd never learn the truth. We didn't find any fingerprints. The police were helpless. Now the murders are happening again. The streets have become dangerous again. A curfew was just announced over radio and television. Young girls hide their faces with handkerchiefs to avoid the threat. My daughter Jackie is the twelfth victim this year. I couldn't protect her. If we stop the murders now, the maniac will be gone for good.
I started to suspect my partner, Chris Lewis. He did his best to justify himself and kept chasing phantom leads. Everyone thought he was losing his mind. Finally, Chris closed the case and quit his job. After that, he just disappeared. Nobody knew where to find him.